Hey guys, this is Michael from McDonald's Aussie Home Fed. Look, I went home and I, I had, I got a phone call saying there's been a fox over at my place and it's been tearing up the chickens. Now, uh, my kids come up with the idea I should go and get a bloody rifle, and I said, no rifles allowed in Australia, boys. Then they come out with this little knife and said, just go and stick him with that. I said, you can't stick him with that. That's not a knife. And I said, this is a knife, man. This is what we do with foxes. But then I realised, you can't use those in Australia either under certain circumstances. I mean, it's only a little toothpick. Then, then, what do I do? What do I do? Well, they come at me with this. Just, just bear with me a second. I'm going to clip it and move it and all that. Just, we'll get there. Anyway, what I was trying to tell you before, then they brought me out this stick, pig sticker. And they said, what's that? He said, Assassin's Creed, they use this. This'll, this'll fix the fox. I said, no, you can't use that. Not legal in Australia. Then, he said, what about this one? They use this in Game of Thrones. I said, no, you can't use that in Australia. So then they come back with this one. You know, they wanted me to use this thing. And I said, you can get them twice. I, a battler, Wolf's battler, no, nah, you can't use that in Australia. in Australia. Cool if you could. So, so what can we use? They said, a to I, and we checked on it, you can use a toothpick. You've got to poke them in the eye. Really? So, watch yourself. You can bring a toothpick into Australia. You can't bring any of those things. Oh well. Oh, then they want to be, they use these. They reckon, you know, skewer him, put him on a spit. Well, can't use them in Australia either. Oh. Well. Then they come at me with a barley song or butterfly knife. Oh, that's a bit of one. And uh, I said, you can't use those in Australia either. Cute though. And then they said, what about a set, uh, homemade knife? No, how about a Second World War bayonet? No, not either. Looks like the fox is gonna get it good in Australia. Anyway, moving on. Okay, you can do it in the back Walking around. So, if you've liked any that you've seen today, please give it a big thumbs up. Give it a uh, subscribe, please, and ring that notification bell. And if you know someone who might like it, please pass it on. Because everybody who likes someone, it shares. Oh, there's my son running away. <laughs> uh, he said, I don't want to be in this video. And he runs off. Jesus. Anyway, uh, look, I'm just telling you that look, I was just about to do my editing. As you can see. And I thought I'd better put a bit of a disclaimer in. Somebody's going to think I'm a wacko. You know, uh, some type of crazy person. I probably am, but, but I'm not that type of crazy person. The type of craziest person I am is the ones that just play around with goats and animals. Um, but these swords and stuff I've just showed you are replicas. Most of them are. Um, and the ones that aren't, well, there's no, you know, there's no harm. But look, they are illegal if used in the wrong, wrong circumstances. And they are like, you know, you walk down the street with it. You know what I mean? Um, so I'm a little bit of playing, I'm playing the tongue in cheek here, okay? So don't take me too wrong. Don't send messages in saying I'm, that, uh, you know, get a, put the police on me because it's not real. <laughs> anyway, hey, catch you later. Bye.